Hello, it's Danny Wallace here. Um, I write um, the Hamish books and some other stuff as well. Um, and I have been given the task of reading out Finn's story. Um, and Finn, you know, uh, this is crazy, but it's brilliant. So it's called Rusty Egg. Once upon a time when eggs were very popular, so popular in fact that people would eat nothing but eggs for weeks, they were so smelly that nothing could grow within a mile from them. Super smelly. In this time, there lived an egg named Rusty Egg, and every day he got rusty. There are a few theories as to why that egg goes rusty, like too much iron in the chicken's diet. The person who ran the museum thought that the egg was laid in a forge and got covered in metal, but no theory was close to the truth. One day, a boy named Joe discovered the real story about the egg. It was a Tuesday, a school day. That meant Joe would pretend to be asleep, so he did. His mum went in to try and wake him. No good. His sister went up. Pointless. Then his dad went in and screamed, Joe, get up right now or I'll confiscate all, and I mean all, your deluxe waste of money, high quality, stupid model cars. Defeated, Joe stretched his arms above his head and gave a large, fake yawn. Pardon, Joe grumbled. Joe, don't pretend you haven't been pretending to be asleep because you have. So Joe climbed out of bed, got dressed and went downstairs. Joe, dear, said his mum, here's your breakfast. Thanks, said Joe as he walked over to the gleaming glass table. He peered in his bowl, then realised that there was no milk, so he walked over to the fridge, opened the door, and glanced at Rusty Egg. He bent down to pick up the milk, then froze and looked up. The egg was shining and giving off a faint glow. He stared and stared and stared. His mum called, Joe, is everything okay? Joe slipped the egg into his pocket, then replied, uh, just looking for the milk, which was half true, at least. Then he filled his bowl with milk and gulped it down, slopping milk all over the table, feeling not too good after. He slipped down from the table and ran to his room to look for somewhere to hide Rusty Egg. He wanted it to be his secret. Bzzzd. Bzzzd. What was going on? His pocket was buzzing. Must have stolen Dad's phone, he thought to himself. He put his hand in and pulled out Rusty Egg. Unsure of what was happening, he laid it carefully down on the table. The now silver egg started rocking, then rolling over the table, then fell on the hard wooden floor, shattering to smithereens. There, Replacing the shattered egg was a metal chick. Its beady gold eyes stared at him and it snapped open its small but sharp beak. Its iron feathers creaked as the chick stretched them wide. With a cough <coughs> and a croak, it started to speak. Hello, earthling. My name is Rusty Egg. From Planet Bong. What was going on? Finn. It's great, man. There's a bit of genius in there. What was going on?